Clark, muscles inside, can't wedge it in. Here comes Tarasi. The no-look flip, Griner the finish. And this crowd will sit. The significant momentum ball that was just overturned. Griner hits the jumper to end the 12-0 run. Stewart just getting smashed by Griner's screens. Griner eventually got three for two. The ball in space and movement. Tarasi gives it up. Griner can't muscle it in. The follow no good. Another chance is good. Mitchell finds Griner. She's been Phoenix's best source of offense in the first, and that's why. She got space by extending that right elbow a bit and was late getting back. Bird has hit her first two from deep. Seven points for Sue Bird. Griner has been a monster in this first half. The defense. Inside, Griner able to do the same. Finish of the foul. Dick got back to it. Griner had a monstrous first half and puts it in there. Griner with 25 in the game. 19 in the second half. Griner has tied it. Gives it up. Under five to go in the fourth. Phoenix trying to force a game five. They're on a 10 0 run. Griner, another. It's a 12 0 Phoenix run and a six point lead. Test. Seattle trying to punch a ticket to the finals. Phoenix doesn't want to go home yet. Brittany Griner. Now with 27 points, eight to shoot. Bonner trying to create. Bonner forces it up. Can't hit. Offensive board, Little. Griner connects on the hook. Time out, Seattle. Brittany Griner puts Phoenix in front after another key offensive rebound from Camille Little. Out of Diana Tarasi's hands. So Dewana Bonner had to make a play. And Camille Little, the veteran who has done many little things in the course of the last couple of games, a huge offensive board, and Brittany Griner comes through again. But this play is kept alive because of the veteran, Camille Little. To the hoop, looking for position, no shot! They don't get a shot off, and that will do it! Phoenix forces game five in 86-84 win! Seattle does not even get a shot off on the final possession.